been working hard, trying to get it in, putting in work. Still doing my thing. I've been working hard, trying to get it in, putting in work. Still doing my thing. Get it. Work, do my work. Got this new angle headed in a new direction Move. Different mentality but still thankful for the blessings Move. I learned some new lessons Everything a teaching moment action Speak louder than words I know who really want it Max. It don't take all day to see if the sun is out Everybody got excuses Ain't nobody running out Hello there Welcome to my channel My name is Faith Dodger And I'm literally the girl next door Today I'm going to show you how I erected my shoe cupboard. Having lived in the United Kingdom, I've had to learn a bit of carpentry, something I never imagined I would ever have to do. A lot of the furniture we buy here comes flat packed. So, the flat packs come with instructions. Some instructions aren't even clear, they're just pictorial instructions, so you have to figure out what they're trying to say. So that's me here, putting together a shoe cupboard. I would say this qualifies to fit into my list of culture shock, because really, I was so used to buying already assembled furniture, but not here. Not that I'm saying all furniture is like that, but if you do buy furniture online, this is what you get three quarters of the time. I will happily say that this has taught me to be self-reliant. I also believe there is no such thing as chores for men and chores for women. I believe that to be a fully equipped human being, one has to learn both feminine and masculine tasks. So I have the tendency of leaving my shoes at the entrance hall. It was beginning to look untidy, too untidy for my liking, so I decided to get a shoe cupboard. You might have noted that I have changed. Well, this wasn't done in one day. When I started this task, I realized right in the middle that I needed a hammer. I was so annoyed because most flat packs come with equipment. I haven't had to buy a hammer for myself in the past, but I had to on Amazon this time. So this is day two when I finished off the job. Don't mind me there, I know I look crusty, but there was no time to look glamorous. Tell me, are you hands-on at home? What tasks do you carry out at home? Comment below. The apartment above me had a leaky boiler. That's why my doorway looks stained like that. Don't mind it. 
we're trying to get it fixed. This part was a little tricky to do on my own. It would have been nice to have a little help, but I managed regardless. This shoe cupboard takes in 12 pairs of shoes, six at the top and six at the bottom. You can neatly pack away your shoes. Really, it makes a huge difference. Ta-da! Job done. Rate me out of 10. What do you think? Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Now that's real. For real though. I'm doing this strictly for my fans. You know what I'm talking about? Strictly for my foot soldiers, my diehard fans. Even if it's only like three or 400 of y'all. Maybe 500 if I'm lucky. I'm doing it strictly for y'all because you've been holding me down. You know what I'm saying? It's real talk. It's Team Nitro, bitch. Yeah. All day. All night. Yeah. Hey, yo, Pope. What up, man? Put a rap on that. Real recognize real. STL to the ATL. Now I'm talking about folks. Let's go.